other on exercise in Siren Sester, we're doing all sorts of like command tasks and patrolling and learning new bits and skills and stuff like that. And we're learning how to live in a basher. What's a basher? A piece of like, um, oh, what's it? A poncho yep. with bungees above our heads and we sleep on the floor on mats. Uh, yes, yeah, so, uh, we arrived uh, here on exercise. Yep. Um, it's uh, settling in uh, to our harbour areas. And around 8 o'clock yesterday, we went on a uh, short patrol, which was interesting to say the least. Um, <laughs> okay, why was it interesting? Well, uh, the person leading kind of got slightly lost. And that was. Uh, <laughs> What can you learn from uh, them situations then? Or what have you learned, sorry, from that situation? Um, just always uh, trust the person up front because they did end up uh, getting us back. Yeah, okay, so trust, yeah, trust in each other. Very important uh, as part of a team to trust, isn't it? Okay, brilliant stuff, sir. Right, so uh, I've had a lovely welcome from Staff Winders. Uh, as you can see in the background, the Royal Navy uh, doing some command tasks, which is absolutely fantastic uh, employer engagement from the Royal Navy. So thank you to every involved from the Royal Navy. So I'm just going to go and interview some learners now. See you in a bit, please. Uh, my name's A.B. Emily Boycott from the Royal Navy Engagement Brilliant stuff. So how are you finding the exercise and in particular, how are the learners doing? They're doing really well actually. I've got them building a comms tower behind me. Uh, they've done a fantastic job given that the time's going to run out in a moment. So they've, they've all achieved the brief. Um, we'll have a little debrief in a moment to see, see how they feel about the activity as well. How do the um, MPCD learners compare to other learners you've visited in colleges? <laughs> They're often more organised. They kind of have um, better idea of how to work together as a team, some of the even mechanical stuff that they need to have a look at, better understanding of some of the things they need to do. <laughs> so it's a powerful then. Um, but yeah, they're, they're very good learners. I love working with you. What's been the best bit so far then uh, on this exercise? Um, my opinion would probably be uh, trying to sleep in that weather last night. <laughs> yeah, it was bad weather last night, wasn't it? But you learned something a lot about yourself last night. So, what did you learn? You know, going through them uh, adverse weather conditions. Um, that uh, no matter the weather, just put, uh, plug down, get comfortable being uncomfortable. Get comfortable being uncomfortable. It's a great saying, though, isn't it? It's a great saying. Get okay. as much rest as possible. Brilliant stuff. Uh, would you recommend MBCT to friends or anybody joining the armed forces? Oh yeah, I'd uh, recommend to anyone. Why? Uh, just because. Uh, since I uh, first joined it, uh, it's helped me with my uh, physical uh, health, mental health, and uh, just, uh, all in all. Brilliant stuff. Well, here I am, back at the uh, exit. Just a thank you to all the learners. Uh, what an absolutely fantastic uh, experience. Uh, the things they're learning about their own character, learning about each other's character, uh, cannot be measured, really. It's that ripple effect. We'll see so many ripples, but we won't see them all. And that's what's happened today in the long-term memory. Uh, I just want to say well done to all staff and learners for what is an absolutely outstanding learning experience for Gloucester MBCD. Well done and thank you.